Good morning, Kane County parents and students. Uh, let's just do a quick little tutorial on how you log into Canvas and how you set up uh, parents as observers and how parents can use uh, the Canvas parent app uh, to observe their students uh, during the next few weeks. Um, so for kids, if once you log into your Chromebook, you should be logged into Gmail and everything else. And from there, you can get into Canvas. And I'll show you that uh, quickly. If you're coming in from a, uh, from a home computer or other laptop, you just head to gmail.com. Uh, if you haven't logged in before, it, or if you have logged in before, it'll ask you if you want to use this account or another account. Uh, I've logged in before, so I'll just use that account. And I'll throw my password in there. And we'll go next. And once you log in with, with your Google account, you've got access to all, all of your other Google apps and things like that that you might be using during this time. Uh, but Canvas is also there as an option. If you keep scrolling on down, you'll find the Canvas one. If you're, if you're a younger student using Google Classroom, that's there as well. So for students, just click on the Canvas link and it should open up that uh, Canvas and get you logged in in a separate page. Uh, for parents, let's have you uh, if you want to log in uh, through a regular web browser, head to canvas.kk12.org and then follow this parents login link. And that'll take you here to, if you already have a login, uh, it's there, but I'm guessing most of you don't. Uh, so you want to follow this link up here on the upper right, parent of a Canvas user, click here for an account. And all you need to do is put in your name, whatever your email address is, and then you're creating a Canvas account, so you need to put in a password twice and make sure they match. And then you need to get a student pairing code from your students. And what that'll do is it'll allow you to observe any classes that they have going on in Canvas. And for each student, you can get a pairing code for each one of your kids, and you'll be able to view uh, all those students right from within either this interface or the, uh, the parent app that I'll show you here in a moment. So kids, how do you get a, a sharing a pairing code for your parents. Let's show you. Once you're logged into Canvas, uh, from your dashboard or wherever you are, head up here to your account button on the upper left and go to settings. And from in there, over here on the far right, or if your screen is small, uh, these buttons may be down uh, on the bottom of this page. Look down there for sure. But you want to find this button that says pair with observer. I'm going to click that and that'll give me uh, this one-time sharing code, pairing code. Uh, it's good for seven days that your parent can use to, uh, to create a Canvas account as a parent. And so let's see how this works on, on the app. So I'm going to bring in my, uh, my phone here and let's go ahead and launch the parent app, Canvas Parent. And now uh, you just go to the, either the iOS, the uh, App Store or the Google Play Store and search for Canvas Parent and it should be that blue icon there. Okay, first step is to find your school. Just type in Kane, and we see down there, Kane School District. Click that, and then I get that same login page again. So I'm gonna get click on Parents, and it's gonna ask me for my login. Parent, if you don't have one already, I'm gonna click on Create Account. Whoops, Create Account right there. And so parents, fill that out uh, as needed and then put in that student pairing code right there. All right, so I'm gonna create a new account uh, as, as a parent. And now I put in my student pairing code and these are case sensitive. So I need to make sure that uh, for this one, my cap locks are turned on, uh, ID8, J-A-W. All right, turns out it was an L instead of an I, so little L, D-A-J-A-W. And so now I am, I am logged in to, uh, as, as observing my, my students here. There's my, and it looks weird because I have the same icon as, as my parent, as my student does, um, but I can click on the class. I can see any grades that have been posted. I haven't done a whole lot of work in this class. Um, if I wanted to see what an assignment was going on, click on that and watch the video. You have access to all of your students' assignments uh, and their grades, as well as the front page of the course, so you can see schedules and things like that. So, 
Uh, hopefully that little primer will help you guys get going. Uh, there also is a uh, student app if students, if you guys want uh, to use Canvas on, on your own phone, uh, feel free to download that student app. Find your school the same way, Kane District. And you're going to log in with the student link and you should be able to sign in with your Google account right there. All right. Hope that helps. Um, let us know if you need anything else. Best of luck.